All right, YouTubers, it's emergency preparedness month. Uh, gosh, we're midway through September and I had a spider bite. I'll show you that picture a little bit later. And I decided to take a look at first aid kits online and whew, that didn't go well. Basically, I'm looking for something that will do uh, spider bites cuts scrapes and burns so i wanted to show you what my medicine cabinet slash first aid kit consists of first thing i discovered is a really stinky old white shirt and another t-shirt stink well, my medicine cabinet has some clippers for the beard. Now, I've had my shaving cream since at least uh, 2008. Another shaver. An empty Ziploc. Some little facial swabs. It's just a Remington cheap shaver. Never really did me any good. Oh, I have a brand new Gillette Sensor 3. They don't make that style anymore. Okay, this is good. The back patch. Awesome. I've probably had it for close to 15 years. This is good. Got to have a back warmer. Haven't had to use it. Glad of that. Oh, more shaving cream. Ha, huh. this package would have come from an old backpack. So we have like a little utility knife, some batteries that are probably oof, super old. That's a snake bite kit, a rain poncho, and I always kept old shoelaces. Because I think they could be used in quite a few different ways. Gauze strip. That's a good one. Good to see. Soft cling. Conforming bandage. 3 inches by 75 inches. I have a little tiny, a super duper tiny 37 piece first aid emergency kit. I'm not sure it's ever been opened. You know, you probably want to open these things when you get them. Take a look at what's really in there. So... One time I got into a bandage and some little swabs, alcohol prep pad, alcohol prep pad, tons of bandages, and then this one looks special, a gauze sponge, and a little mini tiny, super tiny Okay, so then make sure that all fits back in there good and tight. Glow sticks, that's super awesome. Glow sticks, uh, basically can't see or do anything with them, but they sure let other people know that you're there. Oh, 
Oh, this is probably that new style Gillette. All five, ten blades built into one with a terrible connection. But we got that anyway. Shout wipe plush. That's important to have in case you get a stain on your clothes. Just shout it out. Wipe it out. Plus. Very, very interesting. It's like it almost doesn't fit anywhere. So we're going to make a third pile. Hand sanitizer. Who would have ever known? These actually feel empty, even though it's still in the box. Ancient. Ancient, ancient. Yeah, they're completely empty. <laughs> completely empty hand sanitizer. Wow. Uh, fourth, fourth pile will now be trash pile. Oh, mock turbo. Got to have more shaving equipment. This one's probably the old style three blade. That's a good keeper. Toothbrush. Hand sanitizer. This one still has gunk in it, flowing freely. Purell. Very important to always have a lint collector. That has something in it. This is uh, insect repellent lotion. Yeah ancient I bet you can't even find an expiration date on that good to have a nail file ancient Dones back ache relief ancient I don't understand why they never make the expiration dates actually last. So that's like the type of thing that you want to have, but you don't want it outdated. Old cheap Swiss army knife. Never hurts to have one. Especially if it's got a bottle opener. Oh my. Odor Eaters for your sapatos. Ancient. I bought these a long time ago. Fortunately, never had to use them. Oh, Kleenex is always good. Nothing wrong with some Kleenex. Hand warmers. Ancient. Don't know if they would ever work. So much stuff. Some old soap. We'll take the soap out and use it now. Let's see what it's like. I'm sure all the scent is gone. Melt Away Stress Body Lotion, Johnson Softener. Um, well, there's stuff in there. Not something I would want. That's trash. Aha, always good to have scissors. And these are quality scissors, still in good condition. So that's cool. A 
computer printer supply old empty ziplock toss it famous shavers keeper sunscreen from a home company dr horton that probably ancient junk Package is still good. Ancient. Toss it. Aha. Allergy medication. Ancient. But this stuff really works for me. So if I ever have allergies again, keep it. A belt. See, I probably that's old camping belt. Good quality canvas. You could use that as a tourniquet. Guess a lot more could go in there. Oh yeah, more allergy medication. Boy, I had allergies. And one time this was the only stuff that worked. So I stocked up on it. Too bad it's so old. Gotta have your compass. Very important to have a compass. Highlighter probably doesn't even work. That belongs in the office supplies. Breath spray. We'll try that out later. I don't think it has to be in the emergency preparedness kit. A lone bandage that's been opened. So that's not good. But I'm going to put it into our first aid container from earlier in the show because any bandage is a good bandage. Whole bunch of Q-tips. I don't use Q-tips. You're not supposed to put anything bigger than your finger in your ear. Whistle. That's a keeper. <whistles> Never expires. My mag light. This is a true mag light that would fit on your keychain. But started getting hassled with this, trying to go through security just in basic places. Mag light. That's a keeper. Woo, that's that's the find of the night is a mag light flashlight. Oh, more little shaving gizmos. More shaving gizmos. My original Swiss Army knife. Um, it's in very poor condition. It's super chalky. It's losing its finish. So that's not good. I'm not even going to try and open these. Yucky. And Blistex lip ointment appears not to be opened. That's probably old and chunky too. Oh, yeah, that's see. Brown and nasty. That's a no go. That's a toss to the trash. So, as you can see, we have a great, oh, more shaving supplies. I guess I have a lot of shaving supplies because my beard is so long. And this seems to be an empty tap to something. That's a trashola. So I really like using this container because I've had it for ooh, 20 25 years never let me down still very functional all the pieces work on it so now the objective is to fill this with all the right stuff this is close 
and the ones I've been looking at online kind of steer me in different directions. Oh. Interesting about that key. I'll have to think back and see what that key would really fit. Okay, catch you later.